the cases and the hospitalizations are going up in vaccinated people. That's a fact and that means that the vaccines are working. Let's see if you have a vaccine that is 90% effective in keeping you out of the hospitals and you are dealing with a village of 100 people that is exposed to infectious delta. Of those 100 people, 50 have taken the vaccine and 50 have not taken the vaccine. 50 people vaccinated have a 90% chance of staying safe and 10% chance of hospitalization. So out of 50, you get 5 hospital admissions. In unvaccinated group, they have a 90% chance of ending up in the hospital. So out of 50, you get 45 admissions. So in vaccinated group, there are 5 admissions, hospital admissions. In unvaccinated group, there are 45 admissions. Now people start taking more vaccines, maybe they have watched my videos or whatever. And now 90 people have taken the vaccine, 10 people have not. In the vaccinated group of 90 people, they have a 90% chance of staying out of the hospital, 10% chance of being admitted. Still, so you get 9 admissions out of 90. In the unvaccinated group of 10 people, they have 90% chance of hospitalization. So out of those 10 people, 9 people will end up in the hospital. So in the vaccinated group, we had 5 hospitalizations. Now we have 9. In unvaccinated people, we have 45 admissions and now we have 9. Media will present this data to you as that the hospitalizations are same in unvaccinated and vaccinated and the hospitalizations have gone up in the vaccinated group from 5 to 9. Both statements are true but deceptive. Vaccines are working and that's why we are seeing this number, Dr. Ravi Godse.